Channel. This is Sarah Grayson, where grace begins with you. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I have a great video for you today. I, you know, I'm a lover of K.I.L.E. So I've just been stuck on K.I.L.E. fragrances for a long time. I have all of the fragrances in her collection, even to, you know, even her latest releases, which was the, which were the. Um, wedding collection so um, I'm gonna talk about the ones that I, I am stuck on <laughs> the one that has you know that are some of my favorite ones and I'm not they're not gonna be any order or any from you know least to most or anything like that I'm just gonna tell you about the fragrances that have had me stuck on Kale. Before we get started, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely don't forget to share and absolutely don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload more great content. So the first fragrance, this one here, we're going and to get started from the wedding collection, which was limited um, edition. And this one is the Wedding Velvet Santel 35 by Kayale. And this one is supposed to be for the groom or the husband. And I'll get into the notes. The top notes is tea jasmine. The middle notes is white musk, cedarwood. And the base notes are benzoin, sandalwood. It's amber, woody. It's warm, spicy, powdery. It's a musky green, vanilla. It's balsamic. It's white floor and it's a little fresh. This one to me is it can it can be unisex, and this one is to me because it smells. It has that amber woodiness kind of soft, um, soft type of uh, fragrance. It lasts a little, you know, it lasts a few hours on me, maybe three to four hours. It is. A fragrance that's not unlike a lot of fragrances that I have like if you have something like Emma Rain or you have something like um, Santal by Christian Dior I think it's Santal Noir or if you have a fragrance like Givenchy and Decadence those this is the type of fragrance that this um, they kind of mimic each other smell alike so if you have something in that family this is a fragrance that will smell like those other fragrances that I named. I love this fragrance because it's definitely going to be a great fragrance to wear in the cooler months. It's just a beautiful, beautiful unisex type of fragrance. Soft. It's not, it's not feminine or male leaning. It's just soft, ambery, and a little woody, spicy type of fragrance. And this one is the Wet and Velvet Santel 35. I'm getting, I'm just stuck on it. Nice bottle as well. The next fragrance I have for you, Graceful Beauty, is another one that I'm stuck on. I love the bottle. And this one is Silk Santel 36. Let me get into the notes. The notes are Champagne, Freggia, Black Currant. The middle notes are Praline, Nectarine, Jasmine, Orange Blossom. May Rose, the base notes of sugar, vanilla, sandalwood, amberwood, musk, oak moss. It's sweet. It's vanilla, has that nectarine, woody. It's powdery. It's a bit fruity. It's floral. It's amber, has that champagne, white floral. I don't get a lot of the champagne, but we know it's sparkly, like it's bubbly. You know, and that, but you, what do you, you do get is the nectarine from the top until they dry down. This one is just fruity. This one is beautiful. It's girly. It's feminine. It's, it has that um, a little bit of richness, the rose, the vanilla. Also, it has that, to me, it has a cream brulee type of um, note in there. I don't know where that comes from, but that's what I smell. 
It's a beautiful fragrance. I wish I could have. I wish he would have made it in a hundred mil, um, because you can't even find you can't even find this fragrance. Um, you know, it hasn't been back in stock, so I don't know if you know I was going to get a backup bottle, but I can't seem to get my hands on it as well. It's a great fragrance. It lasts a long time on me. This one lasts. Like, I got about six, seven hours. Has great projection. I love that nectarine in this one. I love the praline, that cream brulee kind of vanilla smell I smell in there. Beautiful, beautiful fragrance. And this one is from the Wedding Collection Silk Santel 36. The next one that I have that I've been stuck on is one I've talked Royale, about Sugar before. Patrol, and this 64. This one, the notes of rum, vanilla orchid, jasmine. You get that vanilla, spicy notes, cream brulee, leather, tonka bean rose, the basis, patchouli, agarwood, brown sugar, sugar, amber, and musk. It's sweet, it's vanilla, it's balsamic, it has that leather, but not a harsh leather. It's just in the back. You'll know it if you have a keen nose to know it. Um, it's amber, has a little bit of oud, but rum, it's woody, a little patchouli. This one I get the cream brulee. I get all, I get kind of gourmand. That's what I get, gourmand with the scent. I get booziness from the rum. I get, actually I get a lot of the cream brulee. The leather, you can smell it if you're really, really trying to smell it. <laughs> but it doesn't just, it's not there very prominent. A little bit of the ooh, the brown sugar is sweet. This one lasts a great amount of time on my on my skin. It's beautiful. It's gourmand. It's edible. It's just a lovely, lovely fragrance. And this one is Vanilla Royale Sugar Patchouli 64 by Kayale. The next Kayale that I'm stuck on, and if you've been watching my channel, you know, you know, you know. And this Musk one is 12 by Kayale. The notes, Fregia, Lotus, Middle Notes, Musk, Jasmine, Base Notes, Vanilla, Sandalwood, Musky, it's powdery. It's floral, vanilla, woody, white, floral, it's sweet sensual musky one of the best musk fragrances you're going to put your nose on i'm going to always be stuck on this i have several backup bottles of this of this fragrance because i don't want to do without i hope she keep this in her collection i'm quite sure it's one of her bigger sellers this one is just the beautiful musk if you're looking for musk a musk fragrance a soft feminine beautiful musky sensual um um lovely pretty fragrance this one to me it's feminine 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 this would be that sexy musky fragrance and this one is musk 12 by k ali stuck on this one <laughs> and then we have one that's another big Seller or big hey, fan by K. Hey. Ling. The notes are vanilla, orchid, jasmine. The middle notes are brown sugar, tonka bean, amber, amber wood, musk patchouli, sweet. It's amber, it's vanilla, it's woody, it's powdery. Floral has that brown sugar, that warm, spicy, and it's a little tad bit musky. That tonka bean. This is just a rich vanilla scent one of her best seller if not her top sellers you can layer these fragrances especially vanilla 28 with a lot of fragrances it's sweet it's vanilla to me it's gooey it's just a beautiful beautiful vanilla scent and when you start to get into vanilla you'll compare a lot of vanilla scents to this scent if you have it in your collection because i do it <laughs> i don't know why but I, I, you know, if it doesn't kind of compare to this, it's not a good vanilla scent to me. I don't know why. I mean, I know it's not the top 
or the top tier, but it's the it's the top to me. And this one is Vanilla 28 by K. Ali. Last but not least, last but not least, is another one of my favorites. Another K. Ali fragrance that I've been stuck on is out of her Sweet. collection. Diamond Pink Pepper 25 by K. Ali. The top notes pink pepper, saffron, bergamot, royal lily. The middle notes are Bulgarian rose, may rose, vanilla orchid, magnolia. The base notes are sandalwood, amber, patchouli, musk, rose, warm, spicy, soft, spicy, floral, woody, musky, powdery. It's a little metallic, sweet, amber fragrance. You're going to get spice and you're going to get sweetness. You want sweet, spicy, this is what you want. Saffron is there. The rose, but the rose takes on that floral note. That pink pepper gives you that spiciness. This one is just so, it's a really, really good scent. It's a really, really um, nice, different type of scent when you want something a little sweet and you want something a little spicy that gives you that kick. This is it. And then you have that beautifulness or that um, that uh, loveliness of the rose to just tie it together. And this one is Sweet Diamond Pink Pepper 25 by Kaylee. Now that's just some of the fragrances I'm stuck on with Kaylee. I hope to hear in the comments your favorite K. Ali fragrances. I would love to know them, the ones that you're stuck on right now. Before you go, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely don't forget to subscribe and definitely don't forget to like, guys. It helps me stay in the loops with the algorithms with YouTube. Um, don't forget to share and absolutely please don't forget to hit the notification bell so you will. <laughs> Get notified when I upload new content. I'll see you again soon, my graceful beauties. Take care now. Bye-bye. Thank you.